Welcome back to DX Explorer for another video. Today I wanted to compare the 20 meters of wire that I have hanging right now in my backyard with a 49 to 1 transformer and see how many bands I can get out of this one and also the antenna tuner unit that I built some while ago and uh, recently I had to modify it in order to work with this piece of wire that I have hanging right now. So. I'm going to connect the 49 to 1 transformer and I will do some tests using the Nano VNA. So I'm gonna try. <laughs> to use my phone and see if I can film the nano VNA. If I go to the 40 meters band just as an idea so it resonates on uh, it resonates on uh, 40 meters band 7 megahertz and then again on the 20 meters band uh, 14 megahertz and then it resonates again on 21 megahertz and also on uh, 28 so I have 1, 2, 3, 4 bands out of the 49 to 1 transformer 4 bands with the 49 to 1 transformer which is not bad but uh, I think maybe using a different kind of wire maybe using traps maybe using uh, connectors that I can connect different uh, pieces of uh, of wire to get uh, the right bands I could use a very simple uh, 49 to 1 transformer, especially for portable work, so I don't have to carry this bulky uh, ATU with me. <laughs> but anyway, it's just an idea. The wire is quite low right now, by the way, it's not very high. Um, but I don't have anything in the backyard to hang it, to hang it uh, a lot higher, and I don't have a position. But uh, I'm going to test the a to you right now and see what results and how many bands I can get out with this one so uh, right now <laughs> I'm gonna show you uh, the 40 meters band still with a 49 to 1 transformer um, I have the marker on 7.1 megahertz and SWR, SWR it's 1 to 1 1.167 something around there that's what we get with the 49 to 1 transformer so I have 14.1 uh, uh, megahertz the SWR on that portion it's 1 to 1 1.141 Sorry about this dog barking. That's what I have on 14 megahertz. I think if I can cut the wire just a little bit shorter, I might go a little higher in frequency uh, on all the bands. I'm going to check the 15 meters band. 21 megahertz. And... Uh, on 21.2 megahertz, I have 1 to 1.097 uh, SWR. Not bad, not bad at all. So right now we are on the 10 meters band. I'm. I have the lowest SWR around 28.4 megahertz, and the SWR is 1 to. Um, 1.024 but the problem is that I can tell that uh, the bandwidth it's <laughs> is not that big so the SWR is rising very very quickly 
but uh, well at least I can use a little bit of, <laughs> of it uh, with the wire just as it is right now all right so I'm done with the with a 49 to 1 transformer right now I'm going to uh, test the antenna tuner unit that I modified by the way I'm only using half of the uh, variable capacitor and I removed the parallel capacitor that I was uh, putting it in with the switch but you'll see everything in the blog article so let's connect this one and for this one I'm also using uh, a ground wire which is 4 meters long by the way so I'm on the 80 meters band uh, the lowest SWR it's around 3.6 megahertz and SWR is 1 to 1.3 not bad but not that great either but usable I mean I can use the 80 meters band so now we're on the 60 meters band I'm not even going to bother to go in the center uh, of the band because it's very narrow anyway and uh, the SWR is 1 to 1.12 so I'm on the 40 meters band right now where things started to look very strange uh, the lowest SWR on 7.1 megahertz it's 1 to 1.6 very very strange <laughs> So, on the 30 meters band, I have uh, about uh, 1 to 1 1.197 SWR, impedance around 45 ohms, I guess it's usable, and on the 20 meters band, somewhere around 14.161, I have about 1 to 1. 0.252 SWR 44 ohms impedance not great but usable all right so here's the 17 meters band I'm not gonna bother going in the center of the frequency but the SWR is somewhere around 1 to 1.3 so another band usable so 15 meters band 21.2 megahertz center frequency almost and the SWR it's 1 to 1 1.3 54 ohms impedance not bad usable another one so 12 meters band uh, I'm pretty sure I can adjust it a little bit more but anyway around uh, 24.9 megahertz this one doesn't want to focus I have about 1 to 1 1.3 SWR so it's not bad it's usable so 10 meters band 10 meters band 28.8 uh, megahertz SWR around 1 to 1.3 and the impedance is about 67 ohms it's not bad I mean it's not perfect I'm pretty sure I'm losing a lot of uh, signal using the ATU but uh, it's usable uh, for bad days when you have nothing else I guess it's good but uh, yeah it's, it was done it was done just as an experiment so I'm not gonna bother uh, keep trying to improve it I'm just gonna uh, add the last modifications that I've added on the blog uh, right now with what I have in here to make it work with these 20 meters of wire and pretty much that's it uh, I'm going to continue playing with the 49 to 1 transformers as I like them a lot uh, more they are very tiny and uh, a lot more simpler to make uh, don't doesn't require so many parts so yeah I'll try to play around with that 
and uh, what I will end up playing with a lot more trying to get all the bands using the 49 to 1 transformer is the actual antenna and tune it the best I can possible on each band so I can get all the HF bands possible in one single antenna I will see if I'm going to use traps uh, which most probably I'm going to use traps for my uh, home antenna and for portable I might end up using traps or maybe just some connectors and I can connect uh, different pieces of wire uh, to get the length the length is necessary for me to get uh, that particular band that I want to work on so anyway it was fun uh, trying to compare these two I'm happy the ATU actually works uh, even though I had to do some modifications in the last minute because I, I tried to do uh, some testing earlier and uh, things didn't work quite well so anyway I'm go for sure I'm gonna end up testing it even more from now on maybe with different uh, lengths of wire maybe some random wire but uh, yeah it works so anyway I had to get this one out of uh, <laughs> uh, of my of my head because I was always thinking about uh, if it's going to work or not so I'll see you in the next video until then 73 have a beautiful weekend